Hey everybody, it's Matt Shares, CEO of SBI. I'm gonna to talk to you a little bit about execution as a capability that private equity firms should be assessing as part of due diligence. So if you're watching this and you're a deal partner or an operating partner and you think about all of the diligence effort that you put into it, and having sat through close to 500 diligence assignments over my career, many, many turns of math and pencils in the deal model. What we don't see is people benchmarking and testing execution as a corporate capability. So how do you do that? There's a couple of things. Number one, you need to call that out as part of the questions you ask in the management meeting. And the way you do that is anchoring in on the biggest change initiatives that the company has pulled off, having them gauge and benchmark how they did, what their set of assumptions were, how often they iterated. Number two, you wanna test for organizational agility. How do you do that? Ask them how many things they started and then stopped because they recognized that they were running down a path that was the wrong one. What that tells you is agile culture, they fail fast, and they're paying attention to data and metrics to execute. Number three, look at the biggest execution wins they've had. Are they single-threaded and a function, or did they require the entire company? If you have the functional leaders that are bought in and they can work together, the transformations that you're gonna have to pull off as a private equity investor when you buy an asset require all of the functions to be pulling the same way. If you don't test for that, this is why many of you in year two are very dejected with the asset that you have and you're wondering what happened because the deal model told you it was a good buy. Pay attention to execution, dig into that, and watch yourself outpace the industry and the peers. As always, I wish you good luck as you try and make your number.